It is a wet day, but I thought I'd walk around and show you what we've done so far. Here's a tree or something that they've planted a while back. Can't see it very well. I think whatever what used to be there is now gone. My bushes aren't doing so hot. So it looks like that they're growing back some. This one bloomed a little bit. This one, not looking so good, but it's still got some green on it. Can you even see it? It's like a stick coming out of the ground. That one looks a little rough. But you can see my wooden. Laid out some cuttings that Dave took. Now this is what those bushes are supposed to look like. Like this. And then my azaleas. And then African iris. They look like they're going to be okay. They'll have some brown on them. And then my poinsettias. I planted all over in here. And I plan on filling this whole space with poinsettias. You can see some here by the magnolia tree. I trimmed those down actually recently. And then I found a surprise. A devil's trumpet. You can see part of it has kind of bloomed a little bit. We've had a lot of rain lately, so there's a lot of kind of viney, ivy, whatever, all over the ground. But to show you over here, I still have some jasmine that I need to plant by the fence, but we're putting up some jasmine over here to give us some privacy from the park. This is what I have left to plant. And look, surprise lilies. And we have a pineapple coming up. But we've planted some jasmine here by the fence. We're gonna have it to grow up and to give us some natural screen. Come over here. And I need to put some here, but I haven't been able to because there's a 10 foot heavy metal pole right here against there that we want to get out. And there's the old sign from when all these houses back here were for sale and it's infested with black ants. I tried to pull it out, take it to the curb and ants were everywhere and I could not take it. So I'm not sure how we're going to do that but I at least broke the sign in half. But this is the kids' favorite climbing tree in our yard back here. We come around this way. Got a lot of debris here I need to pick up. And look back out towards the cul-de-sac. Come around this way, between the trees. There's the sign again. Oh, the cows that were held here a minute ago. I was hoping to video them, but I guess I won't. But, Let's see. Oh, I'm back here. Gotta come back a little bit. Dave has been very busy in the trees. You can see here on this tree, he's cut that limb off that was hanging over here and cut it into many pieces. And then if you go this way, he cut that branch off and cut it into many pieces. And we come around here and you can see how our yard now has opened up quite a bit. I'm taking a movie, Stonewall. I'll be there in a little bit. Because of all the stuff we've cleared out to make our yard look bigger and to give us more sunlight. And this is the tree that everybody's scared of when they ride the zip line. You can see how a lot of these trees too have been trimmed. See the big wood pile out there? But this one's getting real close to the ground now. He's excited that it's almost down, but when people ride the zip line, they're afraid they're going to hit this tree, so he's cutting it down. And he's getting close. He told me that it's, get, it's too short now to use his big ladder, so he's going to have to get a different ladder out. And my bromeliads. They come this way. And there's where we climb over the fence to help with that. More rotting stumps. Oh, we got to recover our bikes. Bikes aren't fitting in the garage right now, so we have to cover them with the tarp outside. More azalea bushes. And my Thai plants has got vines on it. I have to pull the vines off. 
I'm always pulling these vines off. This is what I was talking to um, Savannah about. I don't know what that is, but it sure is annoying. I'm always having to pull it out. I'll come back later and pull it from the roots. And then our neighbor's passion flower comes over our fence over here. But I've been pulling the grass out to run my those bushes. They don't have any blooms right now. I had some really nice blooms. There's mom's sign. And then here's my mini rose bush. Look at how pretty they are. Anyway, that's the tour of what's been going on back in our yard. I'll take a close up of this as we leave. We'll see you later. Bye bye.